Hey, welcome to this Photoshop tutorial. In today's tutorial, we're going to learn how to whiten someone's teeth in Photoshop CS4. The method we'll be using is really simple and no more, it takes no more than five minutes and it looks great. It, it doesn't look like anything plastic or it looks real. So, first thing we're, we're going to want to do is make a selection around our teeth using the pen tool. Now, if you're not familiar with how to use a pen tool, I suggest you look at some videos on how to use a pen tool, the basics. And if not, I'll I'll put up a new video on that later. But for now, you want to make a selection on the pen tool. It's going to take a while for the pen to make the selection, so I'll pause the video here and I'll be back when I'm I've made the selection. Okay, so I'm back with the selection. Um, once you have your selection, you want to right click and hit make selection. Now depending on the size of your image, you're going to want to set a feather radius. Now for this image, I'm going to set set a pic 2 pixel radius, feather radius. And if you get dotted lines around the outside of your image, you, what you want to do is go to select and hit inverse. and the outside dotted lines should disappear and only your teeth should be selected now what we're going to do is go down here and we're going to click and bring up the hue and saturation box if you're using anything below CS4 it should pop out but if you're using CS4 it'll be here in the side now this is all we're going to need to mess with and the main tool we're going to be using is the saturation and lightness tool. You can keep the box at master. You don't have to keep it anywhere other than master. And we're going to desaturate it a bit. So bring down the saturation. Don't bring it down all the way or else it'll look fake. But just bring it down to around somewhere around like negative 65 or so. Now we're going to bring the lightness up. Now obviously you want to go all the way up to 100 because that doesn't look like teeth anymore. But you wouldn't want it like anywhere. You, you, you want it somewhere around like 13 or so. Now we're done. That's it. That's all there is to whitening your teeth. Making the selection of what you want to whiten setting the feather radius and adjusting the hue and saturation that's it well not the hue but saturation and lightness now if we look at the before and after you can see there's quite a big difference looks really good if we zoom out again looks good so that's all there is to whitening teeth in photoshop I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and subscribe.